Raka from Indonesia, from the Asian Pacific, Chris. I, I don't know a suburb. I'm not going to. There we go. He got, yeah, we got him. But I think, I think Jakarta might be the capital, I think. Okay, great. I don't want, I don't want to start World War Four here, so, or World War Three. No one, no one cares uh, that much. Jakarta, about Indonesia. What you know about <laughs> geography to start a war. I mean, really? Right. Um, yep. So Jakarta, uh, population 9.6 million as of 2010. Wow. I'm so glad that you've shared this. Meanwhile, I'm watching the minutes tick by. <laughs> what metrics should we be paying attention to in auction insights? Mm. This is... I picked this one. I picked this question because I, this is such a great question yeah. um, because there are a lot of metrics and I have to say there is a friend that Jason and I both share that's, that does Google ads. And um, it, it's, a, it's a young lady that we both work with um, at times. And she gave me a phrase that uh, I had never heard before. And I loved it. Um, it said Google insights is the uh, astrology of or auction insights is the astrology of Google ads. Like, think is about astrology. That. Like I'm a Virgo, you're a Pisces thing. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Exactly. That kind Please of stuff. Explain like, so yourself, Cause I have no idea what you're talking about. I feel like I'm gave, trying to be picked up right now. Like Chris, I'm, I'm, I'm in a relationship. Chris, actually I, I had a dream the other night that oh, two, no. pro- <laughs> two, two prostitutes were closing in on me and okay, hear this careful. out, hear this out careful okay the truth is i turned them down that's how loyal of a boyfriend i am i told my girlfriend that story at first she was mad but then she was like wow you're even loyal in your dreams so i was like i yeah had that dream there and i also in that dream my brother shot shot at me with a gun long (laughs) night (laughs) long night we're gonna have to explore these dreams I, i don't dream anymore um I don't know. I just don't, but uh, I want to hear more about this. I but dream every about... time I look into my daughter's eyes. That's what you Oh should... gosh. Yeah. That's like an old live song. That's, you remember that? Um, okay. Um, all right. So what metrics should we, should you be paying attention to? Uh-huh. Um, basically I like to look at um, the uh impression share but, of but competitors. insights for everyone who doesn't know it's how you can see what other advertisers are showing up on the searches you're showing up on yes and chris yeah, how does you. that relate to astrology it oh so i'm back to this because because it gives you a it, it, trying to pull information and understand where you are in the market and understanding your business and what other businesses are doing by looking at this data uh-huh. i've had clients who try and diverge um, information about what keywords someone else is running or uh, how much they're spending or where they're advertising. And they're running multiple um, auction insights reports for different like ad groups and then some for a campaign and trying to diverge some type of information from this. That's what I mean. You know, it's like, it, it's the astrology of it in the sense that you're, you're looking at some giant thing and trying to get specific information out of it. Um, It is such an obscure metric. And when it comes down to it, the only thing that really matters to me is the search impression share and the position of their ads. So position above or, you know, average position, stuff like that, because here's what I usually do. If they have a very low search impression share and a very high position that immediately tells me, they are poorly managing their campaign because wow. they're bidding way too high. Okay. But if they have a very good search impression share and uh, you know, they're, 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 they're doing, you know, maybe first, second, third position. I know that they're doing a lot better management because they're controlling their keywords. They don't have a bunch of broad keywords and they have no idea what they're doing. They're controlling their traffic. So they're able to control their search impression share and they're showing up in first, second position on a regular basis, possibly beating uh, my client. So Mm. when it comes down to it, that's what I look at. That's what I pull from it. And it's merely, I merely take the idea of, are they beating us? Are they doing better than us? And that's about it. Not are they, you know, not what keywords they're spending or stuff like that. Okay, so Chris, uh, 
I guess the way I would use it, the, the number one way I've used this option insight tool is where clients are irrationally and irresponsibly beating me up about showing up in the absolute top position on their searches on their phones or whatever. And I'm telling them, no, our average position, bro, is 1.1. <laughs> So we are showing up, number one, basically all the time. They're like, not on my phone, not on my phone. And, and then and the, they go, this other advertiser is showing up. We have to bid higher. We have to bid higher. We have to go higher. They sound like a cokehead. Like where they just want to keep going and going and going and going until you're, you're, oh, you're dead. And so what I tell them is, no, we are number one, even though you're not seeing it on your phone. And all you're doing is you're going to get me to bid higher and higher and higher and ruin our results. You're going to ruin your cost per conversion. And so one way I can attempt to prove that to them is I go into the auction insights and I say, look, our impression share is 95%. The big dog that you think is number one all the time, their impression share is 40%. They're not even showing up half the time. It's just on your phone in these random searches, they are. And then I'm able to show them average position and like, oh, we're 1.1 and the other person's average position is 2.5. So I cannot explain why we're, why you're seeing them number one on all your searches, but trust me, when I look at the data in the account, their average position is 2.5. So that's the way I'm using it the most. And uh, Chris, to me, impression share, average position, uh, those are probably the ones I'm looking at most, but they're all interesting. Like it's it's interesting stuff. Like uh, you yeah. get to see, it's, it's really interesting. Like I'll just tell you, I'm advertising on a certain kind of keyword. I have a client that's in the same business and they want to advertise on those keywords too. And they have only been advertising for a week and I see them in the, it's a very niche thing. I see them in the auction insights. Um, so it's, it's real time I'm, or not real time, but it's like very recent. And uh, it, I would say it's accurate based on what I'm seeing. So it, it's, it's probably underutilized. I, I underutilize it. Yeah. Yeah. Good point.